this is the tutorial for the song Ikawa de la Pura Conciencia by Bruno Mansour. It was voted in June's poll by the community and I am going to make two different tutorials. So this is the more intermediate tutorial. I'm going to break down the intro here. And there is also a beginner level tutorial where I'm going to break down the finger picking pattern for the song itself. So the part with the singing. So I'm going to uh, explain what's happening here in this part. Okay. So as you can see, we have a few chords. The chords are A minor, D minor, B7 and A minor again. And what happens is that we're having sort of a melodic bass line. So look what happens, I'm playing the A minor and then I'm changing the notes of the bass. sort of like a melody which is actually being played by the thumb on the bass strings. Um, so first thing is just to go through the chords, make sure you're familiar with the shapes and that you can play the chords without buzzing. Then the next shape is to study the, the, melo the melody movement on the bass. So it goes like this on the A minor. All right, we start with the bass on the fifth string. Play third string, second and first together, and third string. This is like the finger picking pattern for the song. Then we go to the fourth string. Then we add the pinky finger on the fourth string, so we get the third fret on the fourth string. And again, we play the finger picking pattern, and then again the second fret of the fourth string. So we have open fifth string, second fret on the fourth string, third fret on the fourth string, and back to the second fret of the string. Okay, that's on the A minor. Then we move to the D minor chord. Now here we have something interesting. So the melody itself goes like this. We have the open string on the fourth string, then the third fret, second fret, and open string again. Um, but trick here is that when we play the second fret on the fourth string we need to change a little bit the way we play the chord because we need the second finger. So we start with the D minor in standard position which would be with the second finger on the third string, first finger on the first string and the pinky on the second string. We get here and then as we switch to this note we are switching around, we are taking the second finger up from the third string to the fourth string and we use the third string finger for the first string. So we get this shape. This is a little bit challenging. So you might want to just practice this movement from here to here. Notice that I replace the fingers here. The second and third finger. And once you are comfortable with that, you can try to apply the whole finger picking pattern to the D minor. Okay, let's repeat, we had the A minor, now the D minor, now the third chord is the E7, alright, so here we start with the bass string, the sixth string, um, and again we play the finger picking pattern which is 3, 2, 1, 3, then we have the open fourth string, then we add the second finger, so we just get a standard E chord and then we lift it again for the open fourth string and then we're back to the A minor, same thing and that's the intro for the song. Thank you guys for watching, tabs are available for download, this is the intro for the song, there is a separate tutorial where I break down the, the finger picking pattern that is used throughout the song itself with the singing, it's more simple, it's more beginner friendly so if this is a little bit too challenging for you at the moment, start with the, with the basic, the, the beginner tutorial and move from there to this one. Right, see you guys next time.